Welcome to Police 10-8 Talk. I'm Joel. Uh, got a little piece of kit we're going to cover for your duty belts. Uh, like a great many of you, I have always carried a small trauma kit on my duty belt. Uh, recently, uh, with adding some accruements to the belt, I lost some room. So when I changed holster platforms and went to a small drop holster on a multi-flex adapter. I went to this in lieu of the trauma kit. I went to a tourniquet holder where I can keep a tourniquet with me at all times. This particular one is the 1110 rigid hard plastic uh, tourniquet case for uh, Cat 7 tourniquets. 1110 is actually a company based out of Cleveland, Ohio. They do a lot of self-aid and buddy aid type of gear. It's all made in the U.S. of A. The company was founded by an ex-recon marine and a SWAT operator. So together they came up with this idea. In case you're curious what 1110 means, uh, they named it, named the company out of respect for the United States Marine Corps, whose birthday is on November, which is the 11th month, and on the 10th day of November. So November 10th, 1775 was the birthday of the Marine Corps. As I mentioned, this is a hard-sided case with drainage holes in it. This way you can keep your tourniquet close at hand. Uh, it is, it's designed to allow more contact between the case and the tourniquet where the tourniquet won't uh, fall out of it. It also has a big drainage hole here at the bottom. Uh, you can change the uh, patches here. They come in, I think, orange, blue, black. It's, uh, this particular one came with the Blade Tech tech block belt attachment on it since I wasn't mounting it on a belt but on a leg shroud uh, with a little finagling I found out that you could fit the Safari Land uh, QLS attachment to it which is how I have it mounted on my leg shroud the, the cases are available in black coyote tan ranger green uh, leaf wolf gray training blue and rescue orange so that's a quick look at the 1110 rigid tourniquet case for cat sevens so guys be sure uh, give us a like give us a subscribe uh, we're not only on YouTube, we're also on GunStreamer.com and GunPowder.tv. Also, you can give us a follow on Instagram. Uh, so guys, thanks for viewing, and be safe.